Well, a monumental weekend for the local Armenian community. You know, Southern California has the largest population outside of Armenia. Yeah, and hundreds, they came out to celebrate the groundbreaking for a new Armenian American museum. Keiko 9's Rick Monson is live in Glendale where today's event took place. Good evening, Rick. Chris and Amy, good evening. Yeah, this was a big night here in Glendale, and organizers of the museum are now one step closer to opening a place that preserves history and encourages the future of one of the world's oldest cultures. The ceremonial shovels are in the dirt, a huge celebration for this moment at Glendale Central Park, the future home of the Armenian American Museum. The two-story, over 50,000-square-foot facility will house archives, spotlight historical and cultural moments of the Armenian people over the past 5,000 years. To uh, introduce the Armenian culture and also to introduce the other cultures to everyone, to everyone in, in the city. Hundreds of people showed up to mark the occasion, many saying this will be a place to share a history that people may not know yet. What are we learning from, from the pains and the challenges and the difficulties overcome by these wonderful cultures throughout history? How are we becoming better as Americans, learning from them as well? And that's one of the key components. The plans to build the museum began years ago. This groundbreaking comes after millions of dollars in donations by organizations, individual families, and the state. Governor Newsom embraced this museum and was instrumental in getting $5 million the state's invested a total of $8 million into the museum, and I think that's a testament to the Armenian activists. It's going to be a bridge between Armenian community and all other communities in Los Angeles and California. Sharing culture and growing dreams, those are among the many topics this future museum site is expected to help flourish, a place to learn and bring Southern California's diverse community together. To bring in all the people together. Because of, that's L.A., that's, that's, how, that's who we are. There will also be special recognition for the one and a half million people who lost their lives during the Armenian genocide, which until April had not been formally recognized by a U.S. president. The museum is expected to open in mid-2024. Live in Glendale, Rick Montanez, KCAL 9 News.